Hey there, future programmers. Welcome to your very first day on this new journey on my YouTube channel, Children Who Code. Today we are embarking on a wonderful adventure, one that will empower you to build, create, innovate in ways you have never imagined. This is our Zero to Hero Python series. Python, programming, coding, all these words might sound daunting to you, but trust me, by the end of this series, not only will you have Python wrapped around your little finger, but you will also be equipped to conquer any other programming language that comes your way. Let's begin with a bit of trivia. Did you know Python, despite its rather sneaky name, is not named after a snake? It's actually named after a British comedy series, Monty Python's Flying Circus, a favorite of Python's creator, Guy Du Wongos. Pretty cool, huh? And the coolness doesn't stop there. Python is dynamic and object-oriented. It's like this cool, nerdy friend who is always ready to help you out, always making things easier for you. And speaking of making things easier, you might wonder, why start with Python? Why not some other language? Well, Python is like English of programming languages. It's straightforward, easy to understand, and universally accepted. Its syntax is very simple. It's platform independent, open source, and most importantly, it's got massive library support, which can help us do anything about anything. Talking about applications of Python, from building websites, automating tasks, to even making AI and ML models, that is artificial intelligence and machine learning models, Python can do it all. And we will be learning how to do all of these and more in this series. Our journey will start from the basics and we'll raise the bar progressively, delve into complex advanced projects as we move forward. We will not only cover the theoretical concepts, but also get our hands dirty with practice, challenges, notes, exercises, and making our learning complete and well-rounded. But first things first, we need to install Python. Although Python can be installed and run on your personal computer, we are going to use something called Google Colab. Also, I will be creating a separate video if you want to install Python on your system, whether it is Mac, Windows or Linux. Colab, short for collaboratory, is like this super cool playground where you can write and run Python without having to worry about installation and setups. Google Colab. Basically, this collab is a product of Google. It allows you to use Google's hardware, including GPUs and TPUs, which is a big advantage for data science and machine learning tasks. Uh, moreover, the lab seamlessly integrates with Google Drive and Google Sheets. Plus, you can access it from anywhere and share it with anyone. But before we jump into all of this, let's take a step back and talk about what is programming. At its core, programming is just a way for us to give instructions to a computer so that he follows the instructions and get the task done. Think of it as teaching your computer a new trick. And what are these programming languages? These are the languages which you have to use to talk to the computer. So are you ready to start this adventure? Are you ready to step into the world of Python and programming? If yes, then buckle up and let's get started. Remember. Every master was once a partner, and we are in this together, every step of the way. I will see you in our next video. Stay curious, stay excited, and get ready.